What's going on guys, this is Austin off of Faye or Luna, and I would like to start this commentary off with saying I'm sorry for uploading so late in the day. I was trying to record one earlier, but I couldn't because I kept getting interruptions and stuff like that, but I'm here now and I'm here to tell the story, so I'm jumping right into it. So this is the time my parents found my weed, guys, and this is one of my personal favorites because it's one of those stories where it's like not too crazy, but it just involves weed, so you guys love that. <laughs> so... Guys, I have this backpack that I got like a year ago, and I would only use it for paraphernalia and skating. I'd bring it with me when I skated. So I came back from the park one day, and I just got done with the skate, um, a skate session. I was smoking, and um, I came back from the park, and I left my backpack right under my bed. With it was still the backpack was wide open, and it had my weed in it, and my um, my uh, my bowl. So I went to school the next day. Okay, I woke up at a, like. I think it was 7 in the morning, I was waiting for the bus, and I was like, oh, fuck, I left that backpack open, I'm afraid the smell's gonna get out, I'm afraid my mom's gonna see it, I'm afraid something's gonna happen. So, basically, guys, all through school, and I mean, like, I think from, from like, 7.30 when class started, all the way to, like, 2.30 when I was on the bus, I was just like, oh my god, did she smell it, like, what happened, uh, is, is it under, like, is it gonna be under there when I get back, is she gonna see it, like, I was just so scared, and I'm like, I'm like, why am I, so, why are you such a dumbass, Austin, you leave your backpack under the bed wide open with weed in it, so I'm like, I'm freaking out, guys, sure enough, with my luck. I'm on the bus listening to my music, okay? You know, I'm, I'm blasting my logic. You know, I'm enjoying myself. All of a sudden, my, my phone, ding! I look at the fucking screen. And can you guys guess who the text message was from? What do you know? My mom. And it says, You left something under your bed while I was cleaning it. And I was just like, Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> and I just... I remember the bus pulling up to the house and the walk of shame up the driveway to the door. And I open the door. I go into my room. And all I see is just a raided room. It looked like the cops were going... It looks like the cops went through it. Like, my TV was gone. My Xbox was gone. My laptop, gone. Everything was lost. And I was just like, what the fuck? So sure enough, I pull open the bed. I look under the bed. My backpack's laying there. I open the backpack. Guess what's in there? Nothing. And I was like, fuck, 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 fuck. I just started freaking out. Sure enough... I go into the kitchen, there's my mom standing there, and she's like, found something, and she holds up the bag with the drugs in it, and I was just, I was so sad, guys, I was like, great, you know what, this is, this is bullshit, I was like, I was actually trying to, like, plead that it wasn't mine, I was like, I was holding it for a friend, using that classic excuse, and she was like, no, no, you weren't, get in your room, so, here's what the outcome was. She actually had me talk to two police officers, she called the cops, and I had to talk to the police officers for, like, all I really had to do is they just gave me a little talk. I had to attend one, not even attend. The, the cops came to my house and showed me pictures of what weed could do to you. Um, I had to talk down. I had to talk to a bunch of police officers. It really sucked, but you know that's the price you pay if you get caught with that shit. So, um, and I was also grounded for two months. So it sucked because at the time I was actually attaining my old YouTube channel and I couldn't upload for two months. It was bad. Like guys. Try going two months without computer or Xbox or TV, but, like, unless you're Amish, it's a hard thing to do. But that was basically it. Like, it was just a shitty experience. It really was. And, you know, I recommend never leave a backpack wide open with drugs in it because it smells really bad. So, I mean, that's my advice to you guys. That's my story to you guys. Um, I'm sorry it was kind of short. I've, I, I can't even believe I just did this in under fucking four minutes, but that's crazy. But um, anyway, guys, this has been Austin FFA or Luna. Expect a video tomorrow morning, and I will see you guys. Since this story was so short, I'm actually thinking about doing another story tomorrow. So uh, hit, hit the like button if you want another story tomorrow. So, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Leave a comment. I'm trying to reply to every comment I can. Not the hate ones, but the good ones, because you guys are awesome. Anyway, guys, peace.